Uh, Misako Ito, a distinguished guest, fellow open source family members, friends, and colleagues. Welcome to the first Open Tech Summit in Bangkok. So this is the first one for all of us. Thank you all for coming. Uh, thank you for being a part of this exclusive community. It's great to see such an encouraging turnout. Uh, one by one, we are making difference. We're having this presence in Saigon, Ho Chi Minh City, Phnom Penh, Berlin, Singapore, Hyderabad, and many more. And this is the first time in Bangkok. Uh, here in Bangkok, here in Bangkok, we are the best tourist destination, and we have gathering participants from 14 different countries. The event covered two days and have eight different tracks. An exhibition covered a range of organizations working on such different topics like Koto Dojo. And Koto, Koto Dojo, as I have to say, is phenomenal because I have been observing their activities. And it's great to get the kids and commercial uh, kids are able to organize themselves. And we see an elite and software developer creator at this event. Many of them have built successful products that are thriving in regards to community, but also commercial. So well done. We can't, hit, we can't wait to hear more of your stories and learn from your experience knowledge. Uh, the Open Next Summit is organized by FOSS Asia. The organization was founded in 2009 and it's ranked among the top 15 developer organizations on GitHub with more than 400 registered developers. It's exciting to see an event organized in collaboration with many local partners in Bangkok, now connecting developers from around the world. So it is important to know that our distinguished partners and sponsors are working in a global community on solutions to solve everyday problems. We value your engagement in Open Tech Summit especially this in Bangkok. I want to extend a special word of thank to partners sponsoring this event. First, uh, we thank the UNESCO. UNESCO has been working with us for already 10 years. UNESCO Bangkok office has run many events. Together with us, we are especially glad that we are now finally are able to foster our partnership here in Bangkok. And second, because of the UNESCO, our friends in Thailand, we were able to connect with NIA, National Innovation Agency. This partnership is a dream partnership. The support we are receiving is amazing. With the help of NIA, we are able to conduct the event of this wonderful building. We hope that this partnership will flourish for a long time to come. We also thank MySQL and Oracle. We have worked with you for many years, but we also have the chance to meet new developers, friends, and community at this event. MySQL has been a steady and supportive partner at many of our events. Thank you very much. As an organization based in Singapore, we are very happy to have Grab on board at our Thai event. Grab is an ever-expanding service company, not just for rides, but also for foods and other services. At late night hack sessions, we love to use Grab to quickly order some dishes just like last night that we tried to prepare for this event. So it made our life so comfortable and we appreciate your support very much. Audi is a Thai programmer association and our many other supporters, including Kapook, Simples, MBM, and Launchpad, as well as the organizers and volunteers. And in particular, I want to thank you, Thailand lead organizer, Mr. Michali Mukbil. Other team members are include Eden Dang, Beller, White, Wai Ta Chang, Kev Du Tang, and Dr. Marcos Guterres. And we'd like to have celebrated Shimen with our also tonight at the social event and with live music. So you can register at the counters for tonight. We have live music, we have food, so it's the fun night. Definitely not more funnier than the daytimes, but of course you're welcome to register there. So we're believing in making a difference in using technology as a force to make a positive impact, impact in people's life. As our mission statement says, we are bringing together inspiration community across borders and age to form a better future with open technology and ICT. So last month at the UN Climate Change Summit, it took a 15 years old to confront the global establishment, establishment with the words, how dare you? If we adopt that as our main mantra for the next two days, this summit of open source family members in Bangkok will help walk the talk to more masterpiece of UN slogan.
creating the future we want and leaving no one behind. Yes, climate change is pretty much the order of the day, but that is not the only kind of change. Going around this day, over the next two days, you will hear a lot about what more change and the work, how we are spreading knowledge to solve the world's problem. While taking advantage of the opportunities, we also need to start preparing the risks and threats to ensure that we truly do not leave anyone behind, especially those at the lower rungs of the ladder and those who become victims of natural disaster, conflict displacement, geopoliticals, and geoeconomy disruptions. It's only the last two decades that technology has proven what a disruptive force it can be. One can only imagine that the next two decades have in stores. So let's go on working and creating a future we want and ensure that we leave no one behind. Open source can and must be an important part of the solution. Once more, thank you for coming. And next, I would like to introduce you our lead uh, organizer for this event, Mr. Michari Mukbil, to give a remark. Thank you.